Hello everyone, it's me, Anthony Coach here, a guitarist on YouTube. Not too long ago, I did a video where I took on a Paul Gilbert instructional video for 14 days. If you haven't seen it, check it out in my, on my channel. Uh, today, it is the turn of the mighty, mighty John Petrucci. So, as before, I challenged myself, I gave myself 14 days to watch his Rock Discipline video DVD. I'm sure you've heard of it, you may have even seen it and practiced it. And I chose seven guitar licks from it and practiced it for 14 days. And I could only practice for half an hour, 30 minutes maximum a day. You have to stick around at the end because I'm gonna do a guitar solo that includes all the techniques that I've practiced. So I'm just gonna go straight into the licks that I practiced. The first one uh, was a crazy scale fragment run that went down and up the guitar. Here's John playing it. So what you'll notice, and with all these licks, I set up my camera and filmed as I learned them on that first session. So you're gonna see that first session on day one, followed by the last session on day 14. Here we go. <laughs> funny because he describes it as a warm-up. Uh, it was string skipping, some weird leaps going up. What I kept finding that was really annoying was my plectrum kept twisting in my grip. I felt like a beginner again. Here's John playing it. And here's what I managed. Again, day one compared with day 14. By the end, I did kind of manage to grip that plectrum a bit better. <laughs> This one's stupid. Uh, I'm not even going to explain it. Here's John playing it. <laughs> Complete chromatic run of doom. That's what I called it, the chromatic run of doom. Building the speed up for this one was really weird. You have to, f I had to fight the urge to really tense up and I don't think I managed it by day 14 this video bit of ego creeps in I know that people are gonna watch it so I'm really ramping up the speed and being tense in my right hand that is so stupid um, nevertheless here's day one compared with day 14 <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
So there's a lot of alternate picking so far. The next two are some crazy legato runs. The first one is this weird seven note p pattern. Here's John playing it. <laughs> Now what I didn't want to happen with this was turning it into a six note string pattern as the speed ramped up. Like that, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. I really wanted to. As the speed ramped up, I had to keep slowing it down. There's no metronome with this one. Uh, because it's a bit free and easy, so there's no metronome marking. You're just going to see a raw before and after. Day one versus day 14. Here it is. <laughs> The next one I call the ultimate legato run, simply because it sounds like this when John plays it. Really frightening stuff uh, in E minor, but starts on the F sharp. Uh, I loved practicing this one. I didn't find it easy, but that's I think that's why I loved it because it really pushed me. Here's day one versus day 14. <laughs> I hated this. Sweet picking. I like sweet picking. I'm okay at it, but not when it's like this. He does some weird note groupings that I wasn't a fan of playing it. It's weird. The, the way it's... <laughs> No, so they're not even. When I sweet pick, this is oh, what a shot. This is day one versus day fourteen. Day fourteen is it's sloppy. I'm sorry, but this is all I could manage. <laughs> Next time, I really want to push myself into doing something that I've never played before. Maybe bluegrass or chicken picking or hybrid picking, something else. Give me some inspiration in the comments down below, let me know. Anyway, as promised, here is a bit of a guitar solo that uses all these techniques and exercises. This is what I came up with. So there you go, I've been Anthony Couch. Thank you very much for watching. As I said, stop by in the comments down below and let me know what challenges shall I give myself? 14 day challenges. What other challenges shall I do that don't last 14 days and take me ages to make videos about? <laughs> anyway, thank you very much. I've been Anthony Couch and I forever will be. I'll see you in the next video.